if you've noticed your AI assistant acting a bit sharper, quicker, and generally smarter lately, you're not alone. OpenAI has quietly rolled out some significant updates without making a big announcement. I've got all the details for you. Last week, I noticed ChatGPT felt different, more accurate, faster, and just overall better. It turns out others on social media noticed the same thing. The reason? OpenAI had secretly slipped a new version of their 4.0 model into ChatGPT. They eventually confirmed it with a low-key post on X, casually mentioning the update without much fanfare. No big press release, just a simple tweet. Classic OpenAI. If you're curious about what makes this new model special, let's break it down. The updated version of GPT 4.0, now called ChatGPT 4.0 latest, is essentially a redefined and optimized version of the previous one. While OpenAI hasn't revealed all the details, there's speculation about what this update really means. Some believe it could be a part of a broader strategy by OpenAI to release different size models similar to what Google and Anthropic are doing. There's been talk about potential GPT 4.0 AR model and some think this latest update might be a step in that direction. However, I'm not entirely convinced because if it were a brand new model, OpenAI probably would have made a bigger deal about it. So what this can new model do? From what I've observed and others have reported, it's performing better on tasks that require complex reasoning and creativity. For instance, if you've been using ChatGPT for coding or solving tricky problems, you might have noticed it's a bit sharper now. It's also faster which is a nice bonus. However, it's not perfect. There are still some odd quirks like in one test when the model was asked to stack a book, 9 eggs, a laptop, a bottle, a nail, in a stable manner, it suggested putting the 9 eggs on top of the bottle. Obviously, that's not a practical solution. And when asked how many R's are in the word strawberry, it incorrectly answered too. So there are still bugs to work out, but overall, the update is a step in the right direction. Speaking of strawberry, there's a lot of buzz about something called Project Strawberry. The idea behind it is that it could be a new post-training method to enhance the model's reasoning skills. Some people even think the improvements we're seeing in ChatGPT might be the first signs of this mysterious project in action. One of the coolest features of new ChatGPT 4.0 latest model is its improved ability to handle multi-step reasoning. This means that instead of jumping to conclusions, the AI carefully thinks through each step before providing an answer. This leads to a more accurate and thoughtful responses, which is something everyone can appreciate. The AI community has taken notice, especially with its performance on LMS's leaderboard, which is like the Olympics for AI models. The leaderboard pits different models against each other in various tasks, and the new chat GPT 4.0 latest model just set a record, scoring an impressive 1,314 points, the highest score ever recorded. This means it's outperforming some of the biggest names in AI including Google, Anthropic, and Meta. If you're wondering how to access this new model, it's easy. OpenAI has already replaced the old GPT 4.0 with a new version on both the ChatGPT website and app. Just fire up ChatGPT and you're good to go. If you're on a free plan, you might run into some message limits, but if you are subscribed to the Plus plan, you can fully explore the model's capabilities without restrictions. However, even on the free plan, you can still get a good feel for the new model before hitting any limits, and if you do, you can switch to GPT 4.0 Mini. Well, was not quite the same, it's still pretty powerful. Another interesting is how OpenAI has been testing these updates. They've been quietly slipping experimental models into places like the LMS's chatbot arena under random names so people didn't even realize they were testing new tech. For example, the ChatGPT 4.0 latest model was tested under the name Anonymous Chatbot and received over 11,000 votes from users, showing just how clever OpenAI's approach to testing really is. So what's next? Based on this latest update, we can expect OpenAI to continue refining and improving ChatGPT, especially in areas like reasoning, creativity, and other tasks that require more complex thinking. We might even see more developments from Project Strawberry in the future. 
Now let's talk about another new AI model that hasn't received as much attention as it deserves. Falcon Mamba 7B, released by the Technology Innovation Institute TII in Abu Dhabi. TII is known for working on cutting-edge technologies like AI, quantum computing, and robotics. And they've now introduced this new model, which is available in Hugging Face as an open-source model. What really sets Falcon Mamba 7B apart is its innovative architecture. While most of us are familiar with transformer models which have dominated the AI landscape, Falcon Mamba 7B uses a different approach called the Mamba State Space Language Model or SSLM architecture. This new method is gaining tradition as a stronger alternative to traditional transformer models. Why this is important? Transformers are powerful but they have limitations especially when it comes to processing longer texts. Transformers use an attention mechanism that compares every word in a text to every other word to understand the context. However, as the text length increases, this process requires more computing power and memory causing the model to slow down and struggle with longer consequences. This is where SSLM architecture shines. Unlike Transformers, SSLM continuously updates a state as it processes the text, allowing it to handle much longer sequences without demanding excess memory or computing power. Falcon Mamba 7 uses this architecture which was originally developed by researchers at Carnegie Mellon and Princeton Universities. What's particularly interesting about Falcon Mamba 7B is its ability to dynamically adjust its parameters based on the input. This means it can intelligently decide when to focus on specific parts of the text and when to ignore others, making it more efficient and effective at processing complex or lengthy content. So how does Falcon Mamba 7B compare to the big names like Meta's Llama 38B, Llama 381B, and Mistral 7B? TII runs some tests and the results are pretty impressive. When it comes to handling large amounts of text, Falcon Mamba 7B can process longer sequences than transformer models using just a single 24 GB A10 GPU. This means it can theoretically handle infinite context length if you process the text token by token or in chunks. In fact, Falcon Mamba 7B outperformed Mistral 7B's sliding window attention architecture by generating all tokens at a constant speed without any increase in memory usage. This is a big deal for anyone working with large-scale AI tasks because it means the model is both fast and efficient. Even when it comes to standard industry benchmarks, Falcon Mamba 7B holds its own. In tests like ARC, Truthful QA, and GSM8K, it either outperformed or matched the top transformer models. While there were a couple of benchmarks like MMLU and HSWAG, where it didn't quite take the lead, it was still right up there with the best of them. But this is just the beginning for Falcon Mamba 7B. TII has a big plans to keep optimizing the model and expanding its capabilities. They're not just focusing on SSLM, they're also pushing the limits of transformer models to continue driving innovation in AI. With over 45 million downloads of their Falcon models, TII is proving they're a major player in AI world. If you're interested in AI or curious about what the future holds, keep an eye on Falcon Mamba 7B. It's already making waves, and with TII's ongoing efforts, it's only going to get better. If you found this video interesting, make sure to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more AI insights. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.